Hello friends, today I'm going to show you how to create multiple listeners for always on. So here I'm already having one listener. Let's try to create another one. If I try to create, so the availability group already has a listener. Another listener cannot be added. You will get this kind of error. To avoid this error, uh, you need to go to the clue admin, come tools, click payroll cluster manager. Select all was on listener here. Come down. More actions. So add resource here. Client access protocol. Click on this. Here type AG2. Next. Finish. Here you will get that always properties. Okay dependence policies okay so expand this right click on this properties here select uh, DSCB is enabled by default select that this one 10.10.75 10 so just uh, you will get this IP uh, with the Windows admin networking team okay right now 75 is is free that's why we have given 75 click apply click ok here so and right now right click and bring online yeah, this one is also online so if I go to SSMS here try to AG2 I am able to connect but when I do refresh here still it is not yet visible because we need to add dependency here right select AOG A1 here right click on properties go to dependencies here select this one Or select AG2 now go on refresh see you will get you will see the listener so this is how you can add multiple listeners to SQL server I hope you may like this video thank you